These are the hands of the first African-American to represent Louisiana's 7th Senate District, a man who has left that seat to represent even more of us in Congress. And these are the hands of the man who wishes to replace him, a man who has held down a successful law practice and a seat in the Louisiana legislature. For the floor in the bill, Representative Gary Carter. While holding up a family of five, his hands can be seen writing legislation to improve education and to care for our seniors. I'm sorry, I'm emotional about it, but to have a statue to the people who tried to, who enslaved my people, my ancestors, is offensive, members, and it's personal. Or pushing back against racial injustice in our state. Gary Carter is the senator we need, hands down. But as we all know, it's never that easy. Standing in the way are the hands of an extremist who will wave off our concerns about voter suppression, the minimum wage, and police reform. On June 12th, we have the chance to elect someone who will stand hand in hand with us, whether we're white, black, Democrat, or Republican. The future of our community is up to you because the future of our community depends on the people we elect to represent us. So don't let it fall into the wrong hands. Vote Gary Carter, number two, State Senate.